My name is Ed Stellan, and I'm a senior director at Heartland Health Outreach, which is Heartland's healthcare affiliate. I've worked here for 20 years now, and I've had a variety of capacities here, from outreach worker to what I do now, which is more administrative. My name is Carmen Jimenez. I work in the asset building department at Heartland Alliance. Essentially what I do is I teach folks to manage their money a little bit better so that they're able to save and build assets. My name is Lorraine Lynch. I'm the Director of Financial Compliance for Heartland Alliance. My job is to make sure that the program office and the financial office stays in compliance with the federal government. I'm Hatem Shams and I'm a human rights worker at Heartland Alliance. I work as a Middle East Project Associate. My name is Erica Champer and I work for Heartland Housing. My job is to make sure that our properties stay in compliance and that we provide quality, affordable housing to vulnerable populations. The philosophy of care, I think, in terms of what it means, you know, it's that spirit behind the stance that we take, um, whether we're working with program participants or one another or, or other partners in the community. We want to really look at the world from the perspective of those we're serving. What we provide to people, it's not a privilege, it's not something they've earned, it's something that they have a right to, they deserve it solely because they're human beings, um, regardless of their immigration status, regardless of their gender, anything like that. So even in an administrative role, um, I, I absolutely see my role as being a that of a human rights worker. Being a human rights worker means to me um, helping folks make certain that they have a safe place to live, um, and that they're really being treated fairly. We stress the fact that we meet the participant where they're at. One of our, um, one of our employer partners um, is a manufacturing company and they have multiple shifts. And so um, I actually had to teach a class to the third shift employees at one in the morning. Our philosophy of care model is awesome and it's awesome because we are actually helping our participants learn to be sustainable. We're teaching them, we're helping them be um, gain their self-confidence. We don't diminish them, we don't belittle them. I came here as a refugee to the U.S. through Heartland Alliance and I was resettled in Chicago by Heartland Alliance and then the care that I had from Heartland Alliance as an Iraqi uh, LGBT refugee it was a huge, like a family, a second family here. For me personally, philosophy of care takes on a little different form because I don't work directly with participants. One of the things I do is I refinance our properties when it becomes time to pay the loan off. Most people may see that as just refinancing a building. I see it as I'm extending the ability for these tenants to stay there for another 15 years. And so even though I'm sitting behind a desk working on spreadsheets and filling out forms that I never actually meet the participant, it's important to me that I know that the work that I do is for these tenants. What I love about working at Heartland Alliance is, um, I think there's a couple things. I think that on one level, Heartland really stimulates my brain uh, because I have to always be thinking creatively and in different ways to meet the needs of people who who don't fit neatly into to little boxes. Um, but I think it also really stimulates my heart because um, we are charged with being human rights workers and we are expected to, to step up to the plate and to really advocate on the part of the people we serve. And that's a real big part of it for me too. Once we get our systems working right, once we have the program office following our models, and once we have the financial office members following our models, the federal government comes in, they look at our programs, they look at the, the financial side, and they award us by giving us more money so that we're able to help more people. And so actually our grant dollars are increasing. Since I've been here, our grant dollars have almost doubled in four years. That is a testament to Heartland Alliance. Every day is not the same, um, which is what keeps it exciting. Um, so I get to meet with CEOs and I get to meet with HR directors, but then I really, really get to work one-on-one -on -one with a lot of participants. Unlike most real estate companies or landlords, we're not just working for a bottom line. We're also working to fulfill a mission, to make sure that the most vulnerable in society are being housed, and that's important to me. My work is so, so interesting because I am doing things I always wanted to do 
for people who have situations like the one I had. And through Heartland Alliance, I'm fulfilling this dream because Heartland Alliance is all about what it really says, like human rights. And I'm so glad I'm here.